I'm David, and welcome to Happy Turnings. In today's project, I have a piece of fiddleback maple. It is about three inches uh, in depth and about eight inches in diameter. I'm not sure of the profile I'm going to go for yet, um, but we're going to start off by just getting it true to the lathe. About 800 RPM here. Seems uh, about the most stable point for me here. <clears throat> Again, start off off to the side before we make uh, contact with the piece, just in case. Now to keep the tool from bouncing around, I'm putting downward pressure on the tool towards the headstock. I'm not putting a lot of force going into the cut itself. I'm letting the tool do the cutting itself. <clears throat> also, I'm taking light passes to start off with. You don't want to get caught on any large edges or anything like that, any, any gaps there. It's also important to sharpen your tools before you end up uh, starting as well. This is a freshly sharpened uh, ball gouge before I started. I'm not putting up much of any pressure on this at all. Just letting the cut do itself. Just a little bit of pressure involved. Not much. Again, not much at all as needed. <laughs> and easy on coming out. Oops. Clean that up a little bit. There we go. Again, start off low, bring it up from there. <clears throat> I'm actually doing pretty good here. About 1100 RPM. <clears throat>
not bad. Not bad at all. All the way up against there. And no gaps. No gaps. You can see that in there, but uh, there we go. No gaps. No gaps. No more gaps. All right, let's get you out of there. Some days my shop does feel like a little bit of a bonus, huh? My number one. Okay. A little mark on the back of them. I've come to find out and realize <clears throat> my one jaw. Da, 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 da. Oops, you're not working, are you? No, you're not. Yeah. Yeah. There you are. Let's use this little buddy. All right.
want this at full speed, I'll bring it down to about 900 RPM. A little less than that, even about 800 RPM. About half of what we were at before. a little bit on the, uh, the old rag here. Flip her on again. I've got this running. I've got it at about 900 RPM. I'm going to lower it down, actually. Actually, I want this up a little bit. I don't think of it. Let's have it 700 RPM. Not too fast, but you want to uh, want fast enough. Pretty, pretty ball. I like it. Beautiful wood. Some of that silvering in the maple there. Oh. And that fiddleback. Oh, that grain. <laughs> Brings out so much chatoyance from it. It really does. And then we have that sap part right there, that sap ring portion. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Only at about 600 RPM, by the way. <laughs> Waterlocks gloss, original VOC. Stop loss bags are great for uh, your finishes as well. 
Um, this water locks was put in here March 5th of 2023, and this stuff is still perfectly viable, working fantastic. So we're doing good here. Oops, a little bit too much there. Too quick. A little too quick. I always filter my, my finish before it goes into the cup. <clears throat> Just to make sure there's no little crystallites or anything like that getting into it. Crystallites. Fiddleback Maple Salad Bowl here. It's going to be a gorgeous one once this is done. This is our second coat on this guy. Girl, whatever it is, we'll see. Let's not get uh, too picky here. We'll just uh, enjoy it for its beauty as it is. All right. Gonna be a pretty one when she's done too. Love that grain, huh? Love that grain. Let's see, I'll look this side. See that pretty darn good over there? Oh yeah. 